problems here. Mark the clock on in the terrible crash down. And down there gone. And it looks like Ericsson is the man who went. It's like quite beautifully. Oh, that was poetry. Who's reporting? Peter Collins from Bellevue, Manchester, spearheads the British hopes in the 1984 championship. PC now 30 years old, anxious to atone for disappointment in the World Speedway Championship when, of course, he was eliminated at the British final under rainy conditions at Coventry. It's raining here. It's very wet, and we can see in the heat two, Collins is left on the inside as Egon Muller goes through. He's in the yellow helmet there. Flourishing briefly, we have Kai Nimi, number 11, in second place, and Collins, on a machine borrowed from former world champion Alos Weisbach, is picking his way through at the back, and pretty soon makes his presence felt. Muller, three times champion, looking good. Nimi comfortably, it seems, in second place, but we look back and we watch for Collins, and Collins comes bursting into the picture here, as you can see, moving up into second place. Here is Egon Muller, now 35, former World Speedway champion, of course, last year and he suddenly becomes aware that he's got Peter Collins on his two. He's doing, looking back there, Collins has closed right up onto him, and this machine really is moving sweetly. Muller, we always knew, has very, very fast motors, but Collins seems to be on a flying machine here this afternoon. He's way out there on the outside and moving up on Egon Muller, and we really have a superb piece of long track action because the pair of them here are locked together at, what, 85 miles an hour, really putting their necks on the line, nothing in it at all, as you can see, shoulder to shoulder, a magnificent piece of speedway. Collins it is, whose nerve holds, and he takes Muller right out here, and as Muller tries to get his wheels back in line and tries to find the drive, he's right off the track there, onto the grass outfield, and Peter Collins has the British fans in this crowd here at Herxheim really on their toes. He's looking sharp. We know he's courageous. We know he'll get his head down and put himself around. And he really does take Egon Muller apart in this opening race for him and for Muller. And he did it in the most daredevil style. Collins moving on to take five points from his opening ride. Muller back in second place. That's a brilliant opening for the Mancunian. this action again as Collins moves inside of Muller. There's not a lot of room there. Remember, they really are going flat out here, and it takes a man with a very special brand of courage to do that kind of manoeuvre.